Four years ago, this plot was Amne's home until Israeli soldiers demolished it. Now she plants vegetables for her children to eat. Amne lives in Jubbidib, a small village east of Bethlehem. It's located in areas designated as C or under full Israeli control. Israel bans any Palestinian construction here but allows Israeli settlements nearby to sprawl. My husband and I built it brick by brick with our hands. If they don't allow us to build here, we'll have to go somewhere else where we can. Human Rights Watch says this village is a living example of Israel's deliberate policy of discrimination against Palestinians in the West Bank, including occupied East Jerusalem. Spending an estimated $1.4 billion a year on settlements while denying Palestinians access to basic services. Jobedib is surrounded by three illegal Israeli settlements, including Nikodim, where Israel's foreign minister Avigdor Lieberman lives. Settlers there enjoy paved roads and services, while residents here have none. School children and those seeking medical services must walk 1.5 kilometers to get to the nearest road. For the elderly, like Aide, this isolation is unbearable. My daughter went to the hospital. I couldn't visit her. She returned to me in a coffin. I couldn't bid her goodbye. Amne showed me where she and her four children now live, an unfinished apartment in the village center. We took a chance, she said. But her bare home is no different from many others. Not everybody can bear this kind of restrictive reality. So many people in Jubbidib and other Palestinian communities are leaving their towns in search of a better life. According to Human Rights Watch, in the past 10 years, these policies have displaced 31% of the Palestinian population living in communities like this one. Recently, efforts to launch direct talks between Palestinians and Israelis failed after Israel refused to free settlement construction for three months. Now, Human Rights Watch says countries like the U.S. and EU members should confront this Israeli policy to protect a universal principle that discrimination based on race or ethnicity is inexcusable. Nuraudi Al Jazeera, Shubiddi.